Hey. Yeah. He's uh, falling apart on me. No, not really falling apart, but uh, going through a lot of maintenance and a lot of things that uh, just need to be done in this very, very warm winter garage. As I sit here, barely able to feel my fingers, I think to myself, what am I doing? Why am I torturing myself? Why am I putting myself through all of this pain and misery? And then I'm reminded of all the memories that we shared in 2023. So how about we share them together? Here's a summary of everything that we did with Optimus Prime throughout 2023, including school visits, events, and more. Enjoy.
and family. You don't know me, but I wanted to message you and say thank you. Now you may ask yourself what for, so let me explain. I'm a 46-year-old mom of two special boys. One is 13 and one is 9. I've been raising them on my own for about six years. To say it's been a stressful whirlwind is an understatement. It's tough. Like, really tough. I can't even begin to tell you the struggles I have daily to find the smallest motivation. My boys are distant from me. We have a hard time connecting and at times I feel like I'm failing them as a parent because we don't have a lot of things in common anymore. Very few people know this about me, and I don't share this with you as a cry for help. Instead, I'm telling you this because you and your adventures with Optimus are the one thing that has made a difference. My kids love Transformers. Admittedly, I did not know much about it until I had them. Even when they were younger, it really wasn't my jam. But one of them happened to stumble on your YouTube channel and showed me some of the videos you post. And now, we watch your content on a regular basis often making that a topic of dinner conversations, which in a way has helped me reconnect with my kids in a way I never expected. For me personally, it's a cool truck and all, but I'm not really into that stuff. What got me hooked was how you use it and what you do for people. I watch the way you interact online, I see what you do for kids, for schools, I see how you attempt to bring life to the character of Optimus, I see how you deal with the negative comments people make, I may watch in silence, but I see it, all of it. Not only have you given me something new to share with my kids, but you've given me hope in humanity. I don't care if it doesn't transform. What you do with that truck is commendable. It's inspiring. It's motivating. It's clear to me that keeping Optimus the way you do takes time and labor. Beyond that, though, I've never seen anyone go to the lengths you do for others. It gives me faith that maybe the world still has a fighting chance if people like you are fighting for the betterment of it. Joe, you and your family deserve way more recognition for what you do, more than I can possibly give myself. But back to what I said at the beginning, the least I can say is thank you. I know you probably question at times if it's been worth it, but I am telling you it has, because you're changing the world without even truly realizing it. So I hope you read this message with a content heart, knowing that what you do with Optimus Prime truly does make a difference in the people's lives. Thank you from this mom of two, for helping me find a new hope I never knew existed. And that right there is the epitome of why I do what I do. Yes, to inspire my son. Yes, to maybe inspire a few others. But things like this is what makes me look at what I'm doing now and say to myself, okay, it's worth it. So thank you for all of the support that you've all offered me. 2023 and long before for many of you. I am very excited about the opportunities for 2024, but first, I've got to get this guy back together, and I've got a long road ahead of me to do that. So, back to work. Thanks for watching. Oh, leave behind a legacy worthy of a crime.